Alright, now today in this video, guys, I'm actually going to be showing you guys how you guys can sound better, okay? Now, it doesn't really matter if you guys are on a headset microphone, a microphone, studio microphone, whatever microphone you guys are on, this should work. So, yeah, let's just get right into the video. Enough with the apps. Alright, now you're going to see this link in the description, okay? It's going to be VB Audio Software. It's going to be Voice Meter Banana. I use this myself. Now, we're going to go to here, okay? We're going to download the Voice Meter. You're going to just click download. It's just going to open up in a zip file. Okay, now keep in mind, okay, everyone, this is an important step. When you guys open this and click install, okay? Okay, you guys are not gonna hear any audio until you guys open up your voice meter so make sure you guys actually switch devices while you're watching the video so you guys can hear me while i'm showing you guys how to do it now when you guys actually get your voice meter it's actually not gonna look like mine but if you guys are actually good do if you guys go down the link in the description i actually put my settings on there and now what i did i click save settings and then what you guys can do when you get my settings you guys can click load settings and then it's gonna open up okay so then you're gonna see x vapor voice meter settings and then it just goes automatically what i use okay now if that is not working then i'll actually show you guys a better way to do it but for now let's just focus on how to we how do we hear things okay how we hear make sure you guys have your hardware input okay now our hardware input this is literally just gonna be your microphone i'm sorry if i did not mention that sooner switch up change system sounds now when you guys actually switch up change system sounds you guys are going to see this okay you're gonna see recording and playback okay now playback we actually need to go down and we gotta figure out what where the audio is coming out of okay so what we're gonna do we're gonna open up our voice meter and now what i need you guys to do on your pc is just play some random sound so as example i'm gonna be playing some sounds okay now you guys can see that it's moving so whatever one that you see that is moving on this list over here is the one that you want to put as your default device and once you guys actually do that now you're gonna go to the same for recording okay you guys want to scroll down until you see which one is actually moving your microphone now mine is always going to be b1 i think it's always b1 if you guys use b2 or b3 it's just going to be these ones and for playback mine is just i don't even know i changed the name of it but i'm pretty sure it was aux input or something like this but yeah okay then the next thing we're going to do i'm actually going to be showing you guys what option does what okay so if you guys cannot hear anything right now still you guys need to literally turn on a1 now a1 is how you hear every single thing b1 is how people hear your desktop audio so if you guys want to annoy your friends you guys can turn on b1 and they'll just hear all your desktop audio they go hear their self they'll hear you playing music playing your games or whatever and then if we go over here okay this is where we change our microphone now i know i would recommend recommend you guys stay in this corner okay as you guys can see my mic is changing as i'm moving this thing now my sweet spot is right here with my microphone if you guys have the same microphone as me you guys can put the same sweet spot some people's microphone may sound better up here or over here or down here now the lowest you can go is right here now if you have a bassier mic you can actually use that and it'll just make it more bassier now for this over here so we have the thing called limit how to get the limit we're just literally gonna left click and hold down okay left click and hold i use negative two okay a one this is how you actually hear your microphone b1 this is how you talk if i turn this off it would actually mute so look so as you guys can see i was talking but you guys could not hear me Beater gain this is like volume if i turn this up i will get louder okay and gate this is basically noise suppression so noise suppression is really good in this case because you do not need to use any other software or app or whatever or even just the discord one itself so we're gonna have noise gate i, I recommend really like put it on six like i was gonna say six seven but <laughs> that's crazy but i feel like the sweet spot is either five five up to seven is the best and calm you guys don't really play with this it just makes your mic really loud it compresses and boosts it and now if you guys go to your virtual input i don't know if you guys are using virtual uh this side or this side but either is fine so what you guys can do with this thing so okay what you guys want to do is literally click it and it's put your mouse up okay all you guys want to do is put your mouse up and it'll go down if you guys want it down you just do the same it's just up and down up and down so look this basically just makes your audio and your headphones more bassy, okay? So when you're listening to music, playing games, or just talking to anyone, their mic or their sounds will just sound more crisp, okay? It's gonna sound bassier, it's gonna sound good. Now, some people do not actually like this feature, but I like it because I can feel it in my headphones. And now we have a lot of other options, okay? So we're gonna go to menu here, and I want you guys to put system tray and then set as always, right? And keep this setting on, okay? Show help. So what this does is if I hover over something, at the top middle it literally says how do i reset it what's it do and everything right that's basically all the settings now the recommended thing you guys could just do is load in my settings and it should work pretty fine if it does not work pretty fine you guys can also ask for help in my discord server but make sure you guys actually followed every single step or this will not work you guys will not hear your audio you guys just mic will not sound good so that's how you have to really make sure that you guys are literally watching the whole video the whole entire way and then over here okay we're gonna see this little thing now what you guys can do you guys can 
can click this and you guys can put audios in it so let's just say i want the dang sound effect so let's say i want to play some music i want to play this music bro so now we have the no copyright chill lo-fi background music so what i would do i turn off a2 a3 and b2 if you're using b2 to talk then you guys can keep it on but this is my settings so a1 is how you basically hear them okay this is how you hear the music that you're playing if you don't want to hear the music that you're playing and you only want other people to hear it or just hear the sound it could be any sound you guys name soundboard anything okay just anything so what we're gonna do we're actually gonna right click this too so you guys can actually change the volume of it if it's too loud or you guys want it really loud you can play it on load as soon as you guys put it in there it could literally play or you guys can play it on loop so this is a really good feature another thing you guys could do is actually just record someone's voice record your own voice record anything so if we click this and i'm recording okay blah 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 blah. now i can actually play it again click this and i'm recording okay blah 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 blah. so yeah <laughs> you can literally hear me saying the exact same phrase and you guys can just click keep this playing and, I'm, it. And, I'm, and, I'm, and i'm recording just, like, okay blah blah you can just go around with it now b1 keep sure make sure this is on so others can hear it if you don't want others to hear it only yourself you guys can just keep it on a1 and then yeah that's going to be basically it and then we have a master selection here so eq this is basically going to be your equalizer now we can get in a deeper depth of this in another video because these is a crazy step but before we actually get back into the video guys i need to make sure that you guys always stay safe and protected okay so yeah and what malware bites actually does it actually protects you guys really a lot as you guys can see they have some rewards here and malware bites is just mostly a virus scanner so it will always guys keep you guys protected you guys can also download it on the apple store google play store so you guys can have it on your phone while having it on your pc and you can just have it on multiple devices so yeah guys make sure you guys go check out malware bites you guys can secure your devices with the number one malware remover and protection software i use this myself all the time when i'm downloading things because i don't want to get a virus all right now this is actually what malware bites looks like when we open it up okay now you guys get a free 14 day trial okay you guys can actually buy it up too if you guys want to but actually this is really good okay so we have a scanner we have detection history real-time detection i think you guys will need a premium option for this one okay you guys can actually put your digital footprint in here and it will literally tell you guys where you guys are at and all that bro it's actually crazy and then we have a privacy control so these are just controlling all your privacies your window privacies i love 3d app your advertising ids and whatever whatever if you go down over here these are our experimental tools okay so you guys want to click continue create a restore point now me i'm just going to say no because i want to show you guys real quick we have the windows firewall control okay we have startup applications and we have system tweaks now this is for windows 11 so our windows 10 users cannot use this one but overall it's really nice okay it's a really cool design it's looking good let's get right back into the video we got normal modes and we got different modes and everything okay it gets more complex than this but if you guys do have any issues as i mentioned before please make a support ticket in my discord server okay now i might not be replying immediately but i will get you guys and help you guys out real soon so yeah that's actually gonna wrap up today's video i hope you guys did enjoy i hope you guys got the best mic quality possible hope you guys switch your mic settings bro i hope you guys can sound brisk and like chicken wings bro and if you guys actually made this far in the video comment down the word voice meter is cool okay because that's what's gonna show me that you guys actually watched the whole way through the video and it's just really much appreciated okay so yeah i'll see you guys in the next one like subscribe and peace out